Um, we are aware of, of, uh, of the issue of contraband between both countries. Um, and what I can tell you is that uh, it's something very difficult to control because of, of the border. We have 288 kilometers on the border. Uh, we certainly work on the protection of, of the border and try to do our best. But the main response to that, uh, to that problem of contraband is uh, rather to work on the uh, uh, partial scope commercial agreement because that would allow uh, merchandise to come to Belize from Mexico, merchandise to go from, to be exported from Belize to Mexico in a better manner uh, that would make uh, trade more um, uh, easy, uh, f would facilitate the trade, the commerce between both countries, and uh, that would allow, uh, 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 you know, um, uh, traders from, uh, from both countries um, uh, to do a, a, a better uh, trade uh, of merchandises. What did happen in, in Subtente Lopez is that uh, certainly Mexican authorities are trying to tighten the, the supervision, the control of, uh, of uh, the, the products that come to Mexico um, for the safety also not only for, of Mexico but also the safety of Belizeans. And, um, and we have seen good results. Uh, the, the products coming from Belize to Mexico and the products coming to, from um, Mexico to Belize are mainly coming from Chactemal, and we have very um, up-to-date, uh, modern uh, facilities in Chactemal, and we are trying to take advantage of that.